and Virginia, who again, still setting its sights on what would be a sixth trip to the College World Series, need a little magic after yesterday coming up just short. We'll see if the Disharoon Park crowd can spur them to victory this afternoon. thought that we played magnificently in every facet of the game. Certainly we came today ready to play, swinging the bats. Connolly early was outstanding again. And he gets Mets swinging for strike three. I think the biggest thing was just our offense coming out hot today. When the first batter of the game takes the ball deep, uh, the crowds are going to get it. The crowd's going to get into it, and the UVA fan base today was crazy. That's what we needed. I felt like the game was won when we responded in the top of the fifth, and that's what you have to do at this time of the year. He clears the bases, and Virginia does indeed get all three runs back. It was the biggest swing of the game. There were a lot of hits today on both sides, but Ethan's three-run home run was the ball game. High and deep, and this one is out of here! Our team showed up today with a lot of enthusiasm, very focused and very loose. Swing and a ball driven deep towards the left field corner. It might be some history. And how about with an exclamation point? The new and undisputed all-time greatest home run hitter in Virginia history. And now it's postseason baseball. You know, we've been prepared for this, um, you know, since I got to grounds as freshman and since everyone else has gone to grounds. Obviously, we all know what's at stake. They know what's at stake. And that's what makes it great. You know, that's why these young men go to Duke. That's why they go to Virginia. They all want to play in Omaha, and uh, each team has that opportunity tomorrow.